And uh, let's head back, actually, and give them... Uh, take the bell that we're given by the old woman to the sculptor. Oh, Emma's here now. Shinobi Esoteric Text A book of secrets that details a variety of techniques employed by Shinobi grants the ability to learn Shinobi-style skills. Within this text are the innermost secrets of the Shinobi art, such as attacks performed in the air and hiding one's body to avoid detection. Such moves could never be practiced by samurai. Shinobi <laughs> Owning an esoteric text of a combat style will allow its skills to be acquired in the Sculptor's Idol skill menu. Each enemy defeated provides skill experience. Skill points are acquired once enough experience is gained, which can be spent to unlock skills. Some skills can also be learned by obtaining items or defeating enemies. Oh, that's the thing I saw on the top right of the screen. This. Oh. So I guess I have enough to probably get a skill. <laughs> お前さんも来たのか。にぎやかな。こって。物資との。いらぬ心配よ。会いに行くと。まともじゃないんでね。理由がいいこときで死にはせん。<笑> <いらの心配よ>。<笑> How do I give them the bell? I would just go into the statue. I think the statue will. Oh, yeah. Meotsuburi. Suzuno koe o kite yaru tai. I was expecting this to be a cutscene, but it looks like we actually get to play the memory. Reminds me of Dark Souls 2. Oh, that's right. I remember all the stuff with the giants. Yeah. Harada Estate. It looks like it's being raised, burned to the ground. Terrifying. Uh, oh my god. My wife's so good at video games. I am. What's back here? Loot? Nothing? Is it a death pit? I think this is where you fall if you miss. Oh, 
ask what year it is. Oh, I don't like that. That reminds me of Twin Peaks. So we're not just playing a memory, but the wolf is actually aware of this memory, and it's also not what they actually remember. Well, I think it's that they don't remember anything from this time. Yeah. But it's not it's not like just we are playing a memory, but even they are are back here in the memory. Like they're inhabiting the memory space just as if it was a normal space. Like lucid dreaming. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, I wouldn't have died anyway if I went down there. Oh, wait. That was new. Dosing powder. Medicine for treating burns heals the burn status abnormality and for a time decreases burn buildup, increases burn resistance, and reduces damage from incoming burn attacks. When fires used on the battlefield, dousing powder is crucial for survival. Probably giving that to me for a good reason. Let's put it on our hotbar. Oh, you know, I don't need this homeward idol on my hotbar. Yeah. Uh, remove his X. There we go. What were the shards for again? Oh, that was just to like bait one person out. I guess I'll put that on there. I haven't used them yet. Look at them. They also have a sort of one arm thing going on. Just like me, where it's like one arm looks like it's all covered in armor. Other than that, they're wearing almost nothing. Thought they would see? Yeah. Secrets. Can we stuff under the bridge? Oh, wait, you can swim, can't you? Yeah. Oh, yeah, I'm used to Dark Souls. I'm like, don't go into the water. Oh my god, how far out can I go? I mean, I'm sure you can't just, like, swim down the river. <laughs> oh, hey. Treasure carp scale. Sparkling scale from a treasure carp. To the average person, it's just a beautiful scale. But there are some who exalt a certain master who considers these scales among the most precious things in the world. For this reason, collecting them could be worthwhile. That's vague. Oh yeah, invisible wall. Oh, you can kind of do a dodge thing. Like pressing the the dodge or roll button. Also gives you like a boost to speed. Which is also oh, silly God. as fuck. <laughs> oh no. There's something in the water, a big fish. Do I want to... Wait, can you even fight in the water? Probably not. There's... I guess there's a possibility it could come out of the water. Oh, 
I don't know. Let's get to the other side and see if we can backstab the person on the other side of the bridge. Actually, yeah, let me aggro it. Will you come on land? Just disappeared, which is scary. What? Oh, god. Sorry. Oh, asshole. Oh, shit. God damn. Uh, yeah, the fish just went back to swimming. Uh, that was a piercing attack. There's three of those perilous attacks. One requires you to jump when it's a sweep. Um, the grab, you need to... Just dodge, I think? Yeah. I think the stabbing motion, I think it said you're supposed to deflect it, which means it is deflectable. Which is weird, because isn't the whole thing that it's not deflectable? I don't know. Oh, look at all that loot out there. More fish. You can swim. I love this. Oh yeah, another one of those loot balloons. I need to... <laughs> start using them? I need to start using my loot balloons. Is there anything I don't want on here? Not really. It's all pretty good. I think I'll leave it. I'll just use it from my main menu. Yeah, you can go really fast if you keep mashing the button to, uh, like, boost forwards. Like, look at this. Huh? <laughs> oh, that doesn't seem human, huh? Oh, no, it isn't, is it? Do you think it's a trap? I don't know enough Japanese folklore to know. Hmm. Is that fish doing a thing? What is it doing? I think when they spot you, they just flee from you. Seems like it. Ooh. <laughs> Interesting. Pot Noble Haranaga. That is a creepy arm. Oh, creepy? Look at a princess. Oh, one of our little yes. kitties is here. Want some pennies. Uh, yeah. What can I get? Also, do I want to give these up? I mean, probably, yeah, but the description for the scale also made it sound like they might be useful for the master. That they're, like, they probably have another use. Hmm. But let's see what this is. Divine Grass, a secret medicine that fully restores vitality and cures all status abnormalities. One small part of Ashina is exceedingly old. The ancient soil, rocks, and water that pervaded the land are said to have attracted the attention of the gods. The Dr. Dogen studied the plants in this ancient place, resulting in the recipe for this special medicine. Uh, I'm not going to spend it on a consumable. Well, I think you can save them for now, and next time you visit the dilapidated shrine? Temple? Temple. Just like, if there's no new dialogue, then you'll know, like, okay, it's just for this dude. Yeah. What are these other items? The Withered Red Gourd. A curved withered red gourd filled with medicinal water. The gourd's medicine refills upon rest. Reduces burn buildup and slightly increases burn resistance. It cannot heal the burn's status abnormality, however. I don't... Oh, okay, so it's a... Yeah. I see. It's like an additional type of gourd that you can get. I think it also independently refills from the other gourds. Yeah. It just it doesn't heal, it just specifically deals with burn buildup. 
Okay. Mask fragment right. Fragment of an old dancer's mask. The original must have broken into several pieces, and this fragment appears to be the right side of the mask. That's intriguing. Floating passage text. Compendium on the combat arts. Floating passage. Skill unlocked upon acquiring this item. Unleash attacks in a flowing, dance-like form, overwhelming enemies in a fur of graceful aggression. This technique belongs to the Ashina Sword School, although it has been deemed heretical due to its foreign origin. I love that creepy arm. I think that's all the loot in the water. Do you think if they floated down the river in that urn? Oh, maybe they did and got stuck. Yeah. Oh, baby wants on your table. I should block her, right? Yeah. My little kitty wants on my table. But there's microphones and stuff on it. Sorry, girl. There's a lot of doggies there. I love this music. You know, to get past killing dogs being sad, let's just imagine that they're all fursuiters. <laughs> okay. No, don't focus on the fish. Oh no, getting burned. Huh, at first blush, that burn thing seems to behave pretty fam to pretty similarly to Dark Souls. Where, like, you don't get the status unless it reaches max. So you want to make sure it doesn't reach max. Oil. Plain oil. When the jar breaks, the oil covers everything nearby. Enemies doused in oil are easily set alight, causing them to take additional vitality damage from fire attacks and making them more vulnerable to the burn state as abnormality. Okay, well I don't have anything that can cause fire right now. Oh really? You forget, your pussy's on fire. That's true. I can just go, like, everywhere. I mean, I can go in the water. I can go up on roofs. I'm pretty sure I can just run along this wall, right? Can I just go back here? Yeah. Fucking hell. That makes this game feel so different from the usual Dark Souls. They are starting to spot me. There we go. Should be fine. Oh, they have a bow. Yeah, they forgot about me. <laughs> okay. No! Damn! She's really fast. <laughs> Did they just scream as they fell off? Is that them? Hard to tell there's like 50 dudes on your ass right now. Okay, no. Mm. Oh, I can resurrect even in my memory. What happens if I like totally fail my memory? 
The wolf will remember that. <laughs> Loot. You get officially diagnosed with dementia. Are they an enemy? They are. Hey, they're just like napping. Yeah. I wasn't paying any attention to my health. <laughs> okay. Let's try this again. Uh, maybe I won't go all the way over there yet. Can't take them all out stealthily. Got one. Oh. Oh yeah, there's all the murdered villagers. If I can get this bow person up here. Not really. Well, I don't think anybody else has bows. Jumping, do jumping attacks on them even when they, even when they are aware of you, or is it only a sneak thing? Um, let's see. Oh, it's only a sneak thing, isn't it? throw at them? I don't have any, like, bombs or anything. Oh, wait, what was that? I don't know what I just did there. I think you just got their stature killed. This game is so intense. Yeah. Whew. How did these people not notice us? They're roasting marshmallows. <laughs> I guess. Oh, they're drunk, actually, I think. 
Yeah, look. <laughs> well, stay away from the fire, man. to start using more things like fistfuls of ash. Don't I have a lot of them? I have five out of ten. Does that mean ten are in storage? Yeah. Yeah, like I should start using stuff like that more. No, wait. The ten is the maximum you can have on you. So you have half of what you could have. Wait, really? Yeah. It's that rare then? I thought I'd been getting a lot of it. <laughs> ah, balloon of wealth. Must be the same thing, but instead of more loot, you get more coins. If one pops a golden uh, amiibo balloon and prays, da -da -da, more coin for a period of time. Yep. I should be using that here. <laughs> yeah. I will definitely do that. What is this? Flame barrel. An iron barrel that spews fire. Can be fitted to the shinobi prosthetic to become a prosthetic tool. Difficult to control the rage-filled red eyes with the power of man alone. However, a fire-based weapon could be a means of resisting them. They're said to fear fire above all else. The rage-filled red eyes. Have you been using the loot ones? The loot balloons? No, I haven't been using any of them. But I should. Yeah. But yeah, I talked about the red eyes being susceptible to fire. Sounds like demons. Alright, let's take one of those balloons. Hmm. Let's say one of the possession balloons. I don't know how long they last, but... Yeah, let's try it. <laughs> That's so cool. Okay, here we go. Attacks are very slow, I gotta get used to that. Bloons still going? Oh, we got some people with shields up here. There was some loot the other way that you missed. Oh. How do I go about taking them out? Hmm. Oh boy. Let's use some pellets. Yeah. 
Gokan Sugar, sugar candy made by Shinobi Hunters of Misen Temple, sustaining Gokan's blessing. Reduces posture damage taken for a time. Bite the candy and take the Gokan stance to impart its inhuman benediction. Misen monks are well versed in the art of killing Shinobi, an undertaking that demands a body with an unshakable core. Been over here? No. Oh no. Oh, Gonna get a backstab on one wanna... of these? <laughs> Again! Sweet revenge. Don't lose a whole bunch of them. This game's really good looking. Oh god, there's a lot of them. Ah, oh, Jesus Christ. Fucking hell. Nope. Nope. See ya. <laughs> oh god. Oh no. Can kind of fly. Do you think your shuriken would help against that? Oh yeah, probably. Oh fucking hell! I have no pellets left. Oh whoopsie. Uh. Is there something I should take? Dousing powder, <laughs> ceramic shards. There, annoy them. I think you're doused in oil. Yes, I very much am. Hmm. What about the sugar? Reduces vitality damage? Yeah, that'd be good, right? Yeah. Okay, that was a cool stance. <laughs> oh. Oh, right. I don't actually have any pellets, so I can't put them back in the hotbar. Yeah, it's not gonna do much because they have a freaking shield. Not gonna do much because they have a freaking shield. <sighs> Jesus. I don't have a resurrection, right? No. Okay, well, I think we're gonna end the episode here. I'm gonna take another crack at this tomorrow. It's getting pretty late. So, I hope you've enjoyed so far, and we'll be back soon. Yeah.